Hi guys! It's me, Leah Cakes. I'm so, so happy that you're here watching my video today. I have been through a whirlwind and I'm so happy to be back, but I haven't posted anything in a while. I got Invisalign. Check it out! My little teethies are getting fixed. My smile's gonna be gorge. And what else? Oh, I was really sick. I was really sick for a while, so now I'm feeling a little better. And I'm here today on my day off. Oh, I love my days off. I'm here today on my day off to show you guys how to do the perfect wing eyeliner. Yes, you guys have all been asking me for this. Anybody who follows me on Instagram is always like, oh my gosh, Leah, do a tutorial on how to do the perfect wing liner. Even um, Tally asked me to do it. So here I am to show you guys, there it is, the perfect wing eyeliner. So stay tuned and I hope you guys learn a lot perfect winged eyeliner. Here it goes. Okay, so I don't know if you guys understand my intense love for rapid black eyeliner. It is amazing and I'm going to show you how much I love it. I buy it in packs of three. Yep, there it is. This is my favorite ever. It's easy, it's quick, it's amazing. Okay, so, um, how much I use? So many right here. Okay, I gave this to Talia for, um, for Christmas, by the way. She likes it, I think. I'm not sure. But we actually have, um, several different eyeliners that are really, really great for, um, doing your liquid liner. This is also one that a lot of people like from MAC called Boot Black. It's really good. Um, I also like another one called Liquid Last. That's kind of good too. I like the point on that one because it's kind of long and pointy and it gives you a little flexibility. All right, so I'm going to use, um, like I said, Rapid Black. It's the penultimate eyeliner from MAC, my numero uno. Do I hear giveaway? I'm thinking I have plenty here. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys how to do the perfect wing eyeliner with really, really simple technique. What I like to do um, when I'm teaching this at the counter um, is basically to show people how to just do liner, okay? What that means is don't get all intense about your eyeshadow because when you're doing your eyeshadow and you make it all beautiful and then you try to put a liquid liner and you mess up, it's a big, it's annoying, right? Because you gotta clean it all off, you mess up your eyeshadow, whatever. So basically I'm just gonna teach you how to do it with just using like a powder on your eye and that's it. Because that's the real way to like not feel so bad when you mess up because you're not really messing anything up but your eyeliner. So I'm going to use my Urban Decay Primer Potion. Can you see that? Uh-huh, I like this one. Is it upside down? Maybe, yeah it is. This one's Eden. Um, it's kind of like skin tone color. I'm really light right now, so it totally matches me. I'm also going to use my Mineralize Skin Finish Natural in my own shade. And then, of course, we're going to use the penultimate. Um, let me show you the tip on it so that you kind of understand better. See that? Wait, in the light. There it is. Really good. It marks really nice and clean. See that? Love it. I love it so much. Um, it's always really good to have your handy dandy wipes with you too because you never know when you might mess up and having a good wipe just saves the day sometimes. All right so that and then yeah that's pretty much it so let's start. I'm going to use a little bit of my Urban Decay just a hint. Okay pay close attention because I'm going to give you some really good tips on the whole thing. Okay, I just use a little janky mirror. What's important about this whole thing is actually how you hold the mirror, how you hold all this stuff because basically that's going to be, that's the technique. That's how you're going to get a nice smooth line, a nice even finish. So by holding the mirror down like this, okay, I'm creating a nice flat surface for my eye. 
You see that? So practice that in the mirror. Because when you're looking in the mirror and you're trying to close one eye and you're like, that doesn't work. It just doesn't. So I like to hold my mirror down like this to give myself a nice flat surface. You've probably seen that already before, but really simple. I'm not getting too intense right now. I'm just putting on a primer. And the primer is super important for your eyeliner to stay, guys. It's going to give your eye a nice, kind of even, smooth surface, and it's going to make everything stick and last longer. It's also going to help everything to glide on. So I'm just going to use like a little flat brush like this. This is the 242 brush for MAC, and I'm grabbing my Mineralize Skin Finish. So simple. I'm just going to pack it all on, just like that. It doesn't have to be perfect, because guess what? It matches my skin. Just like that, just setting that primer. La la la. You guys like my Invisalign? I'm sure you noticed. Yep. Getting rid of those fangs, guys. <laughs> All right. Simple. Step one complete. Okay. Now, time for the liner. So, just like I just showed you, mirror down, and I'm going to actually start from the center, this is um, basically just your simple eyeliner. Notice how I'm not going for the gold, I'm just kind of attaching it and attaching it and attaching it going little by little by little okay there's several ways to do this by the way I think it's important that you master getting a nice smooth straight line before you try doing the wing See that? All right. Now, when I do my wing, I actually go in instead of going out like that. So I just kind of use my eyebrow as a guide. And I just kind of create a check mark like that. Little by little. Now the one thing I really like about the penultimate is that it's not too watery. Sometimes when it's watery it's like it goes everywhere and everything. This kind of gives you a little bit more control. So there it is. There's my first wing. I hope that looks good. You like it? Now, I don't really consider this a natural wing, because really winged eyeliner isn't too natural if you're going to do it in black. There are different versions of it, but... Alright. Do you want to see how you can start from the outside? Let me show you on the other side. Okay. This is sometimes some what I do like when I want a big dramatic wing. I'm going to try and make it as close to that one as I can. Um, but this is how you can also do it. You can start with the wing rather than starting with the eyeliner on the lid. Watch. So I'm holding my mirror down. I have a nice angle on my my penultimate. I'm not going across like this. A lot of people try to use the point and just go, eh, but it doesn't work. You want to actually hold it at a slant. And I'm going to create my line first on the outside. Sorry, I messed up. But good, I'm glad I kind of messed up so I can show you how to clean it off. Um... make the check mark first and then scoot the line over little by little I'm not trying to make that perfect smooth line 
in one foul sweep. Swoop. Sweep. Uh -huh. I hope I have a good angle on this. Ta-da! I hope that's even. Looks alright to me except for that little guy right there and I'm going to fix that. I'm going to show you how a good makeup wipe can come in handy. You can also use like Q-tips or something of that nature. But, okay, I'm going to take my wipe and wrap it around my finger and I'm just going to be very delicate. Sorry, I'm making faces, aren't I? Okay, I'm going to be very delicate. And just clean it. Sometimes, you can really go crazy and like get your liner really out far. And then just use this as a little trick to kind of create your own cat eye. Like that. And anyone that follows me on Instagram always sees me with my winged liner. And like, this is seriously how I do it every day. And they're always asking me, eyeliner tutorial, eyeliner tutorial. So here it is. You know Talia asked me to do this too? She was like, when are you going to do an eyeliner tutorial? Here it is. Did I get it matching? So this is your time to kind of try to match it. I think I did it. Mm -mm -mm. Did I do it? That's it. So there's your winged eyeliner, guys. I want you to try it. And I think I'm going to give away a couple of these rapid black penultimate eyeliners because they're the bomb.com they're super easy to use and I think you guys need to try this don't be afraid of your liquid liner because it's easy and I just showed you how but practice makes perfect too so just remember that okay I'm gonna go put some mascara on I'm gonna maybe pop a couple fake lashes on and then I'm gonna show you the finished product all right okay so there it is what do you guys think did I make it any simpler for you? I really hope I did. Eyeliner can be super scary sometimes because if you don't have the practice, if you don't have a steady hand, if you don't have the right materials, it can be hard. But I'm just trying to make it a little simpler for you guys. Um, you don't have to use a MAC eyeliner. It's what I use. It's what I prefer. But you can totally find something else, like at the pharmacy. Maybe like um, just a pen with a pen tip, a nice felt tip to use. So I really hope that you guys practice this because that's what makes it perfect every time. Like they always say, practice makes perfect. All right, guys. So I just want to thank you for watching my videos. I really, really appreciate it. I'm having so much fun on YouTube. It's been a little while, and I'm glad to be back. I also want to let you know that I am deciding to do a really fun giveaway. And I've been <laughs> explaining that for a really long time, but finally it's here. So look forward to my new video about uh, how to enter to get the giveaway items. Exciting. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Thanks for watching. I really, really hope that you guys try this. And um, I want to hear what you guys have to say. All right. Talk to you soon. Bye.